Hello YouTube, I'm giving you my review on the uh, Shani Flash. This is the uh, Shani SN600C RT. And um, of course, I use this uh, trigger as well. Uh, it's the SNE3 RTS. And man, let me tell you something. Um, I didn't think well, <laughs> let me get to the point. These been out for a while, and I've watched all the reviews. But let me tell you something. I've dropped this a hundred times. I mean, I'm not talking about like, oops. No, I'm talking about uh, on the tripod. Boom. You know what that means? When, when you're taking a photo and he's on the tripod and it goes, and you take the picture and you look over like, no. Boom! Yes. Then um, I was out next to some uh, rocks and was doing a uh, Calvin Klein style look, and this <laughs> thing fell down the rocks, and I caught it in time before it went into the water, and it still works. Um, I'm telling you that this 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 is the review. <laughs> that you don't want to miss. Um, this battery been in here, man, almost a week. It still turns on. Um, it's not like the young nows. Uh, the battery will just die. Um, I use one. Oh, this is the batteries I use. Um, I use the uh, Energizer batteries, uh, rechargeable. And I put four in there, and man, I was photographing a wedding. This lasts the entire wedding. One set of batteries. But I always have like ton, tons of batteries. Um, Cause uh, I shoot with three lights, uh, but I'm just showing you one. Now imagine, I said I shoot with three lights, and imagine these three lights, these three flashes on the same tripod stand and just going, what are you photographing? You go, no, boom, still work. And I probably look, <laughs> no reason to lie. I mean, right on point. Um, I'm telling you, looking for flashes for your Canon. Um, well, I use it for my Canon, I'm not sure what other series they have or other brand cameras, but the Shani. <laughs> It's the way to go, and I think he's some terrible news. It actually outperformed my Canon flashes. It's something about the way um, I barely shoot in TTL. So if I'm at, if I'm at an event and somebody wants a quick shot, I'll switch over to TTL. And amazingly, just shoot, I was photographing dead on in someone's face, and you know that you can't just put hard light in people's face. There's this crowd of people had on top of the camera. The exposure, some kind of way the Shani kind of knew the right lighting to put out and it went into this circle look. And everyone had the even light exposure. Shot. It was like five people in the same shot. So this is the way to go. Um, I'm not going to too much of the specs um, by this time professional photographers know what uh, uh, speed light supposed to do um, now high speed sync <laughs> no burnout it didn't overheat I mean I I'm, I'm gonna show you look at this photograph right here the, this photograph right here um, a photograph of the of, of this model here and we was like on the hottest day in Texas it was so hot that day that a building caught on fire. And, and look at this image here. And I was shooting high speed sync at full power and over 100 degree sun. Like the, it was, it beams here in Texas. Now I'm not from Texas, I'm actually from uh, Mississippi. But the light from the, the, well not the light, but the sun here is a killer. So I have a, my high recommendation right now is with the, uh, 
the uh, Shani uh, speed lights. And once again, this is the SN600C um, RT. Um, I'm gonna show you some more examples of the photos that I've, I've taken. And I was photographing with the Canon 70D. Um, I had the uh, radio transmitter on top, had uh, three uh, Shani lights. And I want you to look at these amazing, amazing images uh, that I got from this uh, these speed lights. Um, especially this, uh, this check out this downtown shoot right here. Um, I was using a uh, wide angle lens, uh, shooting at high speed sync, dead daytime. I want to say it was probably like twelve or one o'clock in the day. Um, wind was blowing, everything, and this is an amazing image quality. Um, exposures that I'm getting from uh, getting with these uh, the Shani uh, speed light system so it's been out for a while but I just want to take the time and give you a real review <laughs> look at some real images from people that are not that famous like me but are professional check out these images that I that I've got with the system here and you will be amazed um, I have more work coming up. Um, gosh, guys, I'm telling you, <laughs> the power that comes out of these um, that comes out of these speed lights, man, is amazing. So, uh, this is Marcus Vitag closing out my review for the uh, Shani uh, SN600C RT um, speed light system, and you have to get the trigger and. It's not that expensive, but if you're serious about uh, uh, photography work, um, person this is simple. Um, I've just purchased uh, three more, so I have a total of, uh, of six, and my aim is to get another set of three, and also use them for studio sometimes too. Uh, if, I, if I'm not using uh, my studio strobes, I use these for studio as well. And you're gonna get some good looks out of this. And the battery is battery life and this is it'll last a long time. So trust me, you don't wanna be out where the great shots are and your battery dies. So this lasts a long time on even at full power. Um, majority of times when I was shooting, since I'm using three speed lights, um, I would probably get to like uh, one in four, something like that. Um, um, the lowest majority of times has probably been 1 16th. So I've, I, re I, re I received a lot of nice photos at 1 16th. But when I'm cranking it up on high speed and I'm getting up to like uh, 5,000 on, uh, on, the on the shutter speed and higher, um, I will bump it up to 1 and 2, so uh, almost half power. Um, well, I'm sorry, not half power, but I'll get up to full power. Sorry, I'll shoot at full power. This is Marcus Vitag. Uh, you can catch me on MarcusVitag.com or that's my IG as well. But please uh, subscribe or like or leave a comment at the video. Um, if there's anything else you want me to do a review on, uh, let me know. Anything you want me to discuss, let me know. Um, but uh, please subscribe so you know when uh, my new reviews are coming out. I have plenty more. Um, I'm a professional fashion photographer. Um, you can view my work, and when you look at my work, you'll see that I'm no joke, and I do use um, these uh, off-brand uh, lighting systems. Once again, Marcus Vitag, please subscribe.